it's not just that you have a protest, but you have protesters who feel morally licensed to disrupt. And what interests me is the question of where does that moral indignation come from? Where does this willingness to sort of trample on free speech come from? And the answer is, it comes from the 1960s. In the 1960s, there was a slogan that was invented at Berkeley. It's associated with the scholar Herbert Marcuse of the so-called Frankfurt School. And it was called repressive tolerance. Repressive tolerance. More colloquially, no free speech for fascists. Now, what does this mean? Put in sim the simple terms, what it means is tolerance is a good thing. But we on the left who are tolerant do not need to be tolerant of the intolerant. So therefore, if we can find a group that we can dub intolerant, tolerance goes out the window. We are then allowed to block them by any means necessary. <laughs> 